Even a 12-time Olympic medal winner like 43-year-old Dara Torres can suffer from a debilitating injury. With grade 4 arthritis and virtually no cartilage in her left knee, this five-time Olympian sought out the Cartilage Repair Center at BWH. I had so much damage in my knee that um, it was really what were we going to do, where are we going to get the best care, and will I be able to have the same quality of life and be able to swim again. It was really a decision between a knee replacement, which essentially meant uh, stopping sports, stopping athletics, or trying cartilage repair. Dara was a candidate for ACI, autologous chondrocyte implantation. We use chondrocytes that we get in a, in a knee scope. We take these chondrocytes or cartilage cells, we grow more from them. And these chondrocytes already know what they want to become and they want to make cartilage. So there's no confusion there. That whole process takes about six weeks and you grow from about 150,000 to 200,000 cells until you reach on the order of 40 million cells. And then in a second procedure, the patient comes back and now unfortunately we need to actually open up the knee. Um, and that's a process that's about as involved as a total knee replacement because you need to really see the defect. Uh, it's very fine work. And in that process, we implant the cells. And in that space, you inject the fluid with the cells. And then over time, the cells attach to the bone and produce more cartilage. And then eventually, it fills the hole. Basically, it's all me. I'm not getting it from some foreign uh, body or anything like that, anything else like that. It's, it's my cartilage. Dr. Gamal compares this process to filling potholes on a street maybe local municipalities should pay attention. So this ACI, or autologous chondrocyte implantation, um, where I take cartilage cells and put them back into the joint, that's really something for large and multiple potholes in the knee. So that's one of the more advanced techniques uh, that really only a few specialized centers in the US um, apply. I couldn't believe that they did stuff like this. I didn't, I didn't even know they did, and I've even tweeted about it, and people, I have Twitter, and, and people are like, wow, we had no idea that, that a doctor can do this. What can I help you with? Dr. Gamal is quick to point out that every patient situation is different and ACI is not appropriate or necessary for everyone. But for Dara Torres, BWH provided a gold medal solution. As she vies for a spot on her sixth Olympic team, she has already qualified for the next step, the Olympic trials. And there's no possible way I would have been able to do this if I had not come to Brigham and Women's and the Cartilage Pair Center. There's just, there's no way that my knee would be where it is right now and where it needs to be to go for another Olympic Games.